Hey, Cryptocurrency Universe. Hope you guys are doing good out there in this Labor Day weekend. Hanging around the house, getting some stuff done. About to head to the grocery store. See if I can't throw some good grub on the food, on the grill. But, so I just wanted to kind of update you guys. Um, I remember I had two of these graphics cards on the last video. And I was having a lot of problems. I just could not get them stable for the life of me. I tried updating the graph drivers. I tried changing slots. I tried changing the risers. Um, it's like maybe the risers are bad. I tried flip-flopping everything. Um, and then I tried going back to the USB risers. Uh, and I just, I kept trying every possible scenario. And I could not figure it out for the absolute life of me. That little ding you heard, by the way, is my uh, library. Um, they just hit in the pool. That's one of the, <laughs> the library, something new that I've been researching and uh, following. So I've got this card right here, mining library right now as a test. So, um, but it turns out, I remember I told you guys, I got six refurbished cars at a really, really good deal. I mean, an incredible deal. Uh, so... I went ahead and, you know, built the rig and set them all up. And I remember I told you I have another one of these downstairs, which has four of them. And I kept running into problems and problems and problems. And it turns out I have a defective refurbished card. R9-390X is, def is defective. So, and it was so difficult to figure it out. I mean, it, because it worked. I mean, I would literally put it in here with the two cards, and it would run for 15 minutes, 20 minutes. I'd leave it alone. I'd come back, and it was crashed. So I finally figured out, okay, I did this with each individual card trying to figure it out. I was like, okay, maybe it's the card, and let's try testing that. So eventually, I figured out it was the other card. I plugged it in after about 10 minutes, maybe 15, between 10 and 30 minutes, it would vary. The card would just totally freeze. And it would go to, like, zero hashing power. This one would keep running. And it would be, like, really, really glitchy-like. It would slow everything down. So I kept testing it and testing it. And finally called the manufacturer, told them what was going on. And so I've sent that one off to do an RMA. But all the main problems I was having as a beginner, <laughs> I had a defective card. Um, you know, that was for this rig. Uh, this rig probably took me a good four or five days, three days to try to figure it out. And then, uh, you know, I guess I got lucky. I took the bad card out and I got my other four running downstairs. Um, which I'll show you guys that briefly here in a minute. So, you know, man, I'm telling you as a beginner and trying to learn how to do this and put all this stuff together, if it can go wrong, it will go wrong <laughs> um so uh, whew, hopefully i've uh, figured out everything to do with these things i've been building them uh, this is the third rig and i'm thinking about ordering me a whole nother set of these rx 480s i'm testing profitabilities uh, rois uh, trying to see if it's worth the money or not uh, but anyhow i'm gonna go ahead and show you guys the rig downstairs real quick all right, guys, <laughs> don't mind the little silk cord right there holding the graphics card together. It actually just kind of helps support it so it doesn't lean any. But like I said in one of the other videos, I could not figure out how to get this card to run stable up top. I don't know what it was, but again, this was the, really the first rig that I was doing. I just wanted to get this thing running and stable. So I got it running and stable. I mean, it's pulling, I think, 1350 1400 watts out of the wall so i'm only using one evga 1600 power supply i you know again rule of thumb guys don't overtax this run only 80 percent of the load so 80 percent of the load is about 350 um so i am taxing you know that power supply as far as i'm concerned as, as safely uh, as possible all right well, I hope you guys have a great day. Thanks for watching. Again, give me a thumbs up if you like the video. Give me a thumbs down if you don't. Um, like, you know, just also subscribe if you haven't subscribed already. Um, hopefully I'll have a lot more of these videos coming for you guys. Show you and teach you how I'm doing, what mistakes I'm making. Hey, if you see anything I'm doing wrong or have a suggestion or um, teach me, tell me. Leave it down in the comments, guys. Let me know. And if you uh, also have your starting your rigs and building them, show us pictures. Post them down. See you guys. Bye.